What's up ladies and gentlemen, it's your boy AV, otherwise known as AV the Vocalist. Uh, today I'm here at the Daily Grind, a small coffee shop by the Circle of Sedgefield. Um, today I'm here to interview uh, Miss Lees, but we'll interview her a bit later in the show. Uh, but first, we're going to interview a friend of hers, um, Jenna. She's also a member of the Melodrama 2023. We'll ask her a few questions of how she met Lees, Lisa and um, where their friendship actually began blossoming. So let's just jump into it. Uh, would you mind telling us how your friendship actually developed? I first met Lisa when I needed to find somebody to sort out my computer. Okay. And uh, I used the, the where to find it directory for mm -hmm. Sedgefield and up came the IT guy. Mm -hmm. And then I phoned and it was Lisa. Mm -hmm. Lisa is the IT guy and I thought, <laughs> great. So she came, she mm -hmm. sorted out my computer, no problem, very reasonably priced, mm -hmm. and she's been my go-to guy, girl, mm -hmm. forever. Mm -hmm. Which is forever since it was like last year I met her. Oh, okay. But then we got chatting about the fact that she's new to Sedgefield, and then I suggested maybe join something. There's mm -hmm. clubs and societies mm -hmm. and things and get on a committee somewhere. Mm -hmm. So she came to Melodrama. Mm -hmm. Brilliant. She's really enjoying it. She's fitted in lovely. It's a great little crowd and we're having such fun getting to know each other because there's a lot of new people. Lisa's one of them. You're telling us when you actually started joining the Melodrama 2023. My first Melodrama I ever saw was about 10-12 years ago. Mm -hmm. A friend of mine's son was in the show mm -hmm. and we came down to Sedgefield. Mm -hmm never thinking I would live here myself. I mm -hmm. never thought I'll be part of it. Mm -hmm. But I um, saw the advertisements in the edge yes. for auditions yes. and actually wanted to get my daughter in the audition. Yeah. So to motivate her to do it, mm -hmm. I said I'll do it with her. Okay. Uh, when you are on stage and you start doing an acting or so, how do you build your confidence? Oh, the first... The, Auditions were fine, yeah. and then you get your acts, and the first few times I felt, okay, what am I doing here? Mm -hmm. um, but there's no way. Mm -hmm. And then you start uh, getting to know your cast members, mm -hmm. and everybody supports each other, mm -hmm. and as soon as you know your actual words, or yes. you know the, the steps, it becomes a lot of fun. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, it, it comes with practice. Okay, for instance, let's say you maybe trip on stage during rehearsals and so forth. What is your positive feeling um, towards doing better or something? If you trip or mm -hmm. you get your words wrong, mm -hmm. or make a different move to the other. Mm -hmm. Just make as if it's part of the act. Mm -hmm. The audience don't know any difference. So mm -hmm. as long as you don't show <laughs> I made a mistake, just carry on and follow up again. Uh, when you're also on stage with a few of your cast members, what is your positive feeling towards working along with them? I actually think that being part of this group, we get to know each other mm. um, and we're having a lot of fun for charity. Mm -hmm. So in the end, we making a fool out of ourselves on stage <laughs> but we're doing it for charity and yes. that makes it all worthwhile. For people who are trying to join the melodrama, what would you advise them um, to do on what websites they will maybe go um, when the auditions maybe may be starting or so forth, what would you advise them? Um, the age is free. Okay. Keep scanning it mm -hmm. especially from round about June mm -hmm. May June I think yeah they start advertising when the auditions will be and make a note of that night mm. and plan around it mm. and come with a positive attitude and a lot of fun mm. um, it's not serious mm -hmm. we it's a professional show yes. but we have a lot of fun doing it mm. so Come there with the right attitude and come have fun. I'd also like to say this was a very, very tasty coffee from The Daily Grind, just on the roundabout of Sedgefield next to Sam's Charity Shop. Uh, for more, if you would like to come and drink this tasty coffee and eat some nice breakfast, 
uh, do make sure you visit the Daily Grind um, at the First Circle of Setchfield. Um, that was all from us here on the show and hope to see you soon.